So now let's continue with the flash unit. As you can see, we need a flash which operates at 40 Celsius and 10 bar. This is flash unit 2. Let's go here. And the flash is in the separator block. So let's go here. And this is our flash. So click it, add it. Let's change the number to flash. And as you can see, it will require three streams. One in the stream, which is the fit, and one going out and the second one going out which is the liquid so this will be the vapor stream this will be the liquid stream so one important thing right here is to note that even though if I add this and state it as liquid and this as vapor it doesn't matter Aspen will not know the this is not a instruction it's simple a definition of the stream the name of the stream but the vapor will still go here so let's say we do this liquid well, let's say this will be liquid too. So even though I say this is liquid and this is liquid, this will still be calculated as a vapor mixture. Okay, so we have defined this and we still need to add the inlet, double click it, it's now fully complete. Typically, when we treat this as adiabatic, we only state that the temperature remains fixed and the pressure remains fixed. If you want it as well, you could say duty equals zero, and it will be still defined. But yeah, let's st simply state that the temperature is the same, and since the temperature is fixed, this will be stated as fixed right here. Of course, it's going to have vapor and liquid, so let's make these valid phases. Let's run it, and as you can see, everything is fine. Let's go to the results. There are no problems. And if you click here in the flash, you could check out already the results. So it has a vapor fraction, it has heat duty, and so on. So the heat duty is almost zero, as you can see, to the minus 11 power. Of course, it's zero in real life. You will not be heating these units. 